Yo, what's going on everybody? Uh, it's James here. Um, we are definitely in some big swings right now with a lot of stuff. I wanted to give you guys a big update, big news on what's going on. So um, first and foremost, the one thing that everybody's been asking about is PSB dead? No, it's not dead. Um, we've actually just had a little bit of a hiccup with the commentary stuff as well as um, the guy that's been helping me out with the GSSN stuff, which I'll explain here in a second. Um, just everybody's schedule is kind of messed up and we want to bring you guys games with commentary games that we feel will hype you up and things like that. You know, I mean, football season just started. So I know rain actually does a lot of coaching and stuff with that. So, um, there's that Jordan's got his schedule. Um, I've got my schedule. We're getting JJ involved. Um, hopefully we can get Ty involved. Um, you know, we, we want to bring you guys the most premier content for the premier simulation basketball, you know what I'm saying? So it's coming. I got about 15 videos I haven't even dropped yet. And I, I, I kind of want to put it in order because the reason I want to put it in order is, uh, let's say, like we've had Jacksonville in the first batch. They had four games. If I were to get that out of order, yeah, you might have the same record for Jacksonville, but if the stats pop up on the game, it it will suck because then you guys will be like, whoa, 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 they didn't play, they didn't play that team yet. They didn't have that game yet. What are you talking about? I never saw that game. I, I don't want to have that happen. So it is kind of a mix up type of thing, but I'm working with it. I'm working with the guys. We're trying to push out as much as we can. Um, we will have a game here probably the next day or two. So please bear with us on that. Um, second, uh, with GSSN. So I'm going to be real upfront with it a little bit. So the guy who's helping me, CJ, um, he's actually a uh, friend of mine. He actually lives in Chicago. So um, his initial plan originally to help me out with a bunch of stuff is help promote, help, you know, get our name out there. The biggest thing right now with that is I don't want to have to give up a lot of the rights to what we're doing. Um, and if I do that, then... I basically have to follow with whatever is being thrown at us. So um, that's going to be, that. that's the biggest kicker right now. So there's that. He's got his own personal stuff he's dealing with. He's also got a music career. You guys can check him out. It's CJ, CJ, well, I'm doing it backwards on the camera, but CJ Switchblade. Um, he, he's got a few tracks out there. He's been working on that stuff. Um, he actually, <laughs> surprisingly, he wants me on the track. So that, that's how close of a communication we are on this stuff. But anyways, um, the reason why I say that he was really trying to help promote is because at one point he did approach me. And this is right before like we even released game one. He's like, yo, I actually have, um, or maybe I was already a couple games in. I don't remember. But he was like, yo, I got this deal to promote whatever I want, however I want. But we have certain like rules and regulations we have to follow through because it's on an actual TV network. I think I did mention that a couple, you know, a couple months back. Um, you guys can definitely check that on the Discord if you are part of that. Um, but yeah, like I, he did approach me and ask me if I wanted to have content put on. And number one, it, it, it's in Chicago only. So, and I live in Michigan, so that's not really helping our point, but, um, needless to say, he, he would have helped really promote our brand, um, on a public access, um, you know, kind of like how, uh, what was it like reading rainbow and all that stuff that we used to watch when we were kids and in high school and whatnot, um, magic school bus, all that. Well, oh my God, nostalgic, but anyways, so um with that being said i pretty much talked to him i told him i said listen you know i mean i don't live that far from work anymore i don't live an hour away i don't have a lot of strings holding me down school's about to start especially so i'll have definitely a lot of free time to get what i want done how i want it done things like that give me more of the full reins and he's like dude how about this like 
the project is fully yours. So I can literally say I am now the owner of GSSM. So that, that's, that's the biggest thing right now. Because I was working with him on stuff. He was working with me on stuff. Things like that. So, um, Next on the docket, I'm going to swing it over to my man Jordan. So we're going to do some weird transition thing. And whew, it's going to go to Jordan. And Jordan's got some news for you guys. So hold up. Hey everybody and welcome back to the Global Simulation Sports Network YouTube channel. Uh, so glad you could be here for today's announcement video. Um, obviously this is a, a big time for the, for the GSSN and for the expansion of the league. Uh, obviously today we're going to be talking about the baseball sim league that's being added, the name, logo reveal, and more. Uh, but first I do want to clear something up. Uh, it's been kind of said by a couple people in the Discord that this is or wondering if this is replacing basketball or not. This is not replacing basketball and this is just adding on to the content we already provide for basketball through the Premier Simulation Basketball League. So it's just an add-on, just expanding sports, expanding games, so on and so forth for the future of the Global Simulation Sports Network. So, with that being said, this is a league that is going to be run through MLB The Show 22. Uh, and originally, when we, uh, we announced uh, that we were going to do this, as I communicated with a couple other people, this is originally just going to be an eight-city uh, uh, league. And so, I want to go ahead and announce those first eight cities um, within the league. So the first one will be the city of Indianapolis. Indianapolis getting a team, followed by New Jersey, Charlotte, Orlando, New Orleans, San Antonio, Los Angeles, and Las Vegas. All eight of those cities are getting teams to start, so congratulations. There's a little caveat to that. <laughs> so like I said, there it was, it was originally... It's supposed to be an 18 league, about a 57 game season. However, we found out due to constraints within MLB The Show in certain game modes, it's going to have to be a little bit bigger than that on both sides, which means a full 30 team league, a full 162 game season. Now, obviously, we will not be showing all 162 games for each and every single team on the YouTube channel. There will be select games, select series that we will show every single week. And then at the end of the week, we will have a team recap with results, with stats, uh, standings, everything like that. So even if your team was not shown that week on the YouTube channel, you will still be able to see what happened with your team uh, when it comes to that week's action uh, in the Baseball Assembly. Now, I want to go ahead and revealed to y'all as this next bit of the announcement slash informational video the official league name and logo this is something that uh, I've worked on for a little bit um, and finally we're able to get this thing announced so without further ado here's the official name and logo of the brand new league So there you have it. That is the official name and logo, the Simulation Baseball Association. I am so happy to get this thing underway. I have been wanting to do something like this for the, probably the past year and a half. So to finally be able to have the opportunity to do it is such a great thing. And I want to thank the GSSN for allowing me to take part in this and to be able to be the commissioner of this league and to be able to create this league. Now... With the, like we said, the 30 teams that are involved, uh, the first eight we've already announced, we'll be releasing the other 22 cities as we fill ownership and GM spots um, and as it gets closer to the actual start date. Now, the start date will be sometime, hopefully, in the next 
month, month and a half. We'll kind of have to see how things play out. Um, right now we do have openings. Every single player who comes into the league, first off, every single person who comes into the league will have a player. You don't have to play in the game, but you will have a player, at minimum, that will play in the league. Whenever you create the player, that player then becomes a draft prospect. And from there, there will be draft workout videos and things like that posted for all of the GMs in the league to see. And wherever you get drafted, that is where you will be. You'll start out in AAA unless the GM slash owner says you, that he wants you to start in the majors. And so with that being said, at that point, let's say your player is originally 18 years old. The general manager decides, I want this player to start in the majors from day one. Your age will get bumped up to 20, so that way... You will have an even 20-year career at most uh, within the league. So something really cool to be able to, I guess, kind of be a part of. And she'll yeah, spend a couple years in the minors. Why not, you know? Um, but, yeah, so another cool thing about it is that the rosters have changed. It is not using the live rosters. It's using completely customized rosters. Uh, and so that alone gives your player an even bigger opportunity to potentially get to the majors even quicker now going on that customization the big thing about this league is the fact that this entire league is fully customized custom team names from different cities a good amount of them will not have a will be in a city that does not have a major league baseball team uh some might have a minor league baseball team in real life but usually we're trying to go for ones that do not have a major league baseball team with obviously a few exceptions but f completely customized team, completely customized name, completely customized uh, uniform, logo, whole nine yards, like I said, rosters. And then the cool part, and the thing that I think separates this league from the rest, customized stadiums. If you're an owner and GM of a team, you will have the option and the ability to design and, and have a custom stadium created for your team to officially make it your home. And I think that's the coolest thing about this league is the fact that it's going to be 30 custom stadiums for 30 custom teams in this league. I am very much looking forward to seeing how that all plays out. Now, with the different roles I mentioned, like I said, every person who joins the league, no matter what you are in the league, you will have a player playing in the league. There are also roles open uh, 15 uh, spots are open for commentator roles. Now, I say 15, it's probably more so like 11, 12, as we do have a few commentator spots already filled out. So if you want to be a commentator and call uh, any of the action, let me know, DM me in Discord, and I will be sure to get to all y'all as soon as I can. Now, the other thing, too, is we have owner slash GM spots open as well. Those will fill in the same role by the same person. Uh, and we have 28 spots open for that one. We already have two owner slash GMs, myself being one of them, and another person in the league as well. So definitely, if you're interested in being an owner slash GM of a team, DM me as well. We're trying to fill as close to, if not all 30 teams, by the start of the league. Uh, as far as I can tell, I want to say that's it for now. If there's any more information uh, that I forgot in this video, I will be sure to answer any and all questions within the Discord. Um, oh yeah, a couple other things actually that aren't related to the league, but just GSSN overall. So one thing is that within the next seven days, probably actually about seven days from now, we will officially unveil the official Global Simulation Sports Network website. This is something that I'm creating myself and something that the GSSN approached me with and said, hey, we've seen what you've done in the past and want you to create our website for us. So that's something that is going to be pretty exciting to see. It'll have both the Simulation Baseball Association and the Premier Simulation Basketball League info teams, whole nine yards, all sitting on that one website so you have one place for absolutely everything so that's going to be a pretty cool thing and then also something that we are doing 
is that coming up in the next week, maybe a couple weeks, we are going to be rebranding the Discord. So instead of just being a Premier Simulation Basketball League Discord, it's going to now turn into a Global Simulation Sports Network Discord that's going to have multiple roles depending on what league you're in and things like that, what interests you, so on and so forth. Like I said, that's going to be coming hopefully in the next couple of weeks. We're kind of trying to figure out all the kinks and the way we want to optimize it, the way we want to design it and things like that. So for now, it's going to stay as the Premier Simulation Basketball League. We'll start trickling in some baseball channels here and there just to kind of get the process going and get people started to separate between leagues and stuff. So that way, uh, if you only prefer to be in PSB, that's fine. You'll only see that content. If you're in both, you'll see both. If you're only in baseball, you're only in baseball. So kind of working all of that out. But yeah, so I think that's about it for me. Uh, I want to thank you all for tuning into this video. Obviously, I am very excited to get this league underway. And I'm excited to see what comes about and see who comes out as a shining star and, and who wins the first ever league championship. So I want to thank you all for tuning in. And I will see you all on the diamond. All right. We back? That's pretty awkward. Okay. So anyways, uh, yeah, we're going to be bringing baseball to GSSN. Um, the biggest thing right now is, you know, we're trying to build up the rosters. We're trying to build up everything from the structure all the way up to whatever. So how, how Jordan runs that, because that's going to be his baby. Um, you know, I'm just kind of like the creative mind outside the box. So, but this is, this is totally Jordan's ballpark. <laughs> But um, that's the biggest thing right now is, you know, we want to bring you guys more content. We want to bring more um, more things aligned with, uh, you know, what an actual sports network is like. So we, we, we got a lot of things that we're working on and, you know, to kind of hold us back on the PSB. I, I don't want to say that, you know, it's a bad thing, but, you know... Um, there is one more project coming and I just don't know how to promote the stupid thing. Um, I really don't. It's not even stupid. It's, it's pretty awesome. But, um, God, you know, I'm sorry. It's hot as balls in here. So, um, I'm going to unzip my jacket just a little bit. There we go. So, um, yeah. I just don't know how to promote it. But that'll do it for uh, this little update video of what's going on. Um, like I said, uh, it's it's a work in progress. We're, we're definitely trying to bring you guys the content we need. Um, but other than that, that's all I can really say. Thank you guys for like, sharing, subscribing all the time. Uh, thank you for tuning in. Um, your support really means a whole lot to us. Um, other than that, peace.